you in a form. You gotta get hot like this. You gotta get hot like me. You gotta get hot like this. You gotta get hot like me. What it do, folks? I am back here with another one. This one is something a lot of people don't even know about. Don't mind my hair, don't mind shit, you feel me? Yes, son, yes. This game is gonna be breathtaking. I'm talking about life changing. But I can go ahead and take that back. I can't say life changing because I think they about to go ahead and cancel this game. They've been working on this shit since like 2015, I think. Hmm? And it's looking pretty damn good. You will learn several ways of asking nature for help. Like in this case, how to call an eagle. Look how beautiful that world is, bro. I see. Wait, what? But the most Did he just call or further. summon his bird or something? State of trance to take control of any animals. How can they show so much? And don't take it serious, you know what I'm saying? Because this looks amazing. Has special skills and abilities that will help you survive in this harsh environment. This eagle has a very powerful vision, which will help you to spot and catch small creatures like those snakes yes. over there. Wait, the, nigga, the bird. I was just watching this on Discovery Channel last night. I know that bird. The bird scoop the damn snake up. I know that's just something basic, but what game other than Red Dead 2 you see that in? You know what I'm saying? Because that was fucking amazing. You mean to tell me your your pet gonna carry it back to me? I know it. This dude didn't just summon, and well, I keep saying summon, but call a bear. He called a freaking bear, man. And he's riding a bear, dog. I swear, this game looks amazing. How the hell I haven't heard of this game until February the first of 2024? It's also very fast and friendly mount. Which is quite handy to travel across the vast and seamless mm -hmm. world of wild. The bear. Whoa, dude. Nah, that was dope. I got it. Yeah, that's dope. Y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe. And I'm going to let y'all go ahead and enjoy the rest of this video. Please tell me what you think. Oh my god, just tell me what you think. This reminds me of Brother Bear, but self one of them is still human. You know what I'm saying? finally reached a sacred location where I will be able to summon the snake divinity in order to save my the poison the poison member of my clan. But those summoning altars can be surrounded by dangerous tribes. In this case, a frontal attack would be a bad idea. Luckily, I can use the wildlife living here. Okay, let's attack that camp with a rabbit. The rabbit is very useful to stick into this cannibal camp, undetected. Once again, I can use the wildlife around me, be creative and find my own solution. Let's use those raisins. Now, my plan is to distract those crazy cannibals. This will give me an opportunity for more direct attack. Let's see if it works.
Now that the area is safe, I can finally reach the sacred sanctuary. There's a lot of places like that in Wide, and I have the freedom to choose which one I want to use. Here, I can summon the divinity I want, depending on the type of animal I will bring. The snake divinity could teach me how to make an antidote or control a snake. 